Hi, welcome to How to Repair. In this video I'm going to be showing you how to change a latch or catch on a tumble dryer. Now these can be fitted to square door machines and also round door machines. The actual locking mechanism is exactly the same. Now what actually happens is with these over a period of time, either due to the plastic getting hard and becoming brittle or people forcing the door, the actual latch itself breaks. And if I show it you as a comparison here, you can see the top half of the latch has broken away. Now what a lot of people do not understand is when this breaks, sometimes the actual door mechanism can be stuck in the locked position. This means that the pin, when you fit it, will not shut correctly inside the door. So you need to make sure it's in the open position as it is here. Now to pull these into the open position, I've got a small piece of wire with a hook on it, which I put in and behind the lever and then carefully flick it back over as you saw then. So if I reset it, you can see it's shut in the locked position and you have to pull it into the open position. The reason why I use this small piece of wire instead of a screwdriver because if you're using a screwdriver you're actually levering it upwards. So with the hook you're able to get behind it. Show you one more time. So you're able to go underneath behind the hook and then carefully pull it into the open position. Now when the catch goes in it actually rotates and locks in place to stop the catch coming out. Changing the actual latch itself is very easy. Uh, basically all you have to do is undo one screw the latch tilts over, comes out sideways Grab hold of a new latch, drop it in, put the screw back in and the job's done. The only reason I'm actually making this video is so people understand because we have sold a few where customers have bought it and said the door will not shut and this is because they're not resetting the latch position. Now if you're unsure about the latch when you come to shut the door it won't click into place and that's because the latch is in the locked position so I'll just move this over now when you shut the door it locks straight away to get a new latch for your tumble dryer we normally need the full model number so if you put this into the search on the website the full model number off the identification plate this one has worn away here there's a sticker on the actual back of this machine which gives me the full model number sometimes you'll be able to find the latch but do take a close look at the pictures of the latch using the uh, model number which is here uh, that might not be the complete model number so if you have any doubts whatsoever please use the contact us page on the website, the links will be above or below and we'll help you find the correct latch for your tumble dryer. Thank you very much indeed for watching this video, I hope you found it helpful. Remember you can all support the website by clicking on the like button. Thanks very much indeed for watching.